What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. This is Ken. This is the first video of the 2020 season and I do apologize uh, for being so late in the season for that, but we're here, we're hunkered down and I hope you guys are doing well. So today's video is gonna be a little different. Uh, today's video is gonna be all about lawnmower blades and that's what we're gonna talk about today. So we're not gonna talk about the yard quite yet, but we're gonna come back and address some things in a later video. Excuse the face, uh, as you can tell, uh, there's been no shaving going on because I've been at home for about seven to 14 days. And so yeah, that's what that's about. So, but again guys, today's video is all about lawnmower blades. So I've been getting a lot of questions about lawnmower blades. Should we sharpen, should we buy new ones? You know, what's my particular ideal and pick on that? Well, there's a couple things you need to know first. Uh, one, you, it's always good to sharpen your lawnmower blades. It's never wrong with buying a new lawnmower blade either. So one thing about sharpening the blade, you just wanna make sure you go with the grind. I don't have a sharpener here at this particular house. I did in my last one, but we don't have one here. So what we're gonna to wanna to do is make sure you go with the grinds of the blades. And if you start seeing chips and stuff in your blade, that's when you wanna go and purchase a new one like this. So, all right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get this lawnmower uh, blade changed out. We're gonna come back and I'm gonna show you guys what's been going on in my backyard and then uh we'll wrap it up all right guys so right here i'm going to show you my old this is the one i just took off this is the lawnmower blade as you can see all those chips and stuff like that uh once your lawnmower blade gets looking like this you know it's probably best to go ahead and get a new one as you can see it's bending depending on what i stuff that i hit it's you know it's rusted you know somebody probably can get it sharpened out but it's it got all these chip marks and stuff like that so I mean that's about time for a new lawnmower blade and that's why we are putting in a new one today and hopefully this one will give us a better cut with some sugar wheels and one thing about new lawnmower blades guys you do not have to sharpen those so those come already pre-sharpened so got this better off and we're gonna put on a new one all right guys as you can see i got the new blade on uh so yeah so we're gonna get ready to do a test cut to make sure that's that's good but as you can see the new blade is on all right guys so i mentioned to you that um, i'll show you guys something going on in the backyard and part of the reason why i started my season a little bit late with these videos uh in my backyard um it's been raining so much uh, throughout the year and no matter what i did it just it looked like almost looked like a like a lake back here it was just so much water so i'm gonna turn this around and show you what we did we just had some company come through a company that we've been working with on a lot of the stuff we've been doing in our backyard so we had them to come back and do a french drain let me show you guys what that looked like so this is what we've been doing we had a french drain duh we had some of these little spots right here they kind of dug up and they flipped the grass over and flipped it back over and we got it going all the way out here we had about 150 feet worth of drainage that we um, put we got everything hooked up from this particular down spot right here and it's going all the way out over here we're going to put two more in this area right here because that's a low spot out there i can fill it with sand and i can fill it with you know soil and stuff like that but we're going to put two more out there then i'm going to come back and do some leveling but that's what we've been doing right now and it goes in here and coming out right here throughout the fence and it actually goes all the way down toward the street so yeah that's what we've been doing and as you can see it kind of curves around right here so All right, guys, so this is going to wrap this particular video up. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Got a couple more videos that are coming out there to you. And I apologize for being late on the season, but had to get some things done in the back. So if you have any questions about anything else, yes, we're going to be using a lot of Simple Line Solution, but we're also going to be switching things up and using some other stuff as well on the front and on the back. So stay tuned for all of that. I really appreciate you guys. Y'all have a good one. I'll see you next time.